darkness. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Ooh, I don't like that song already. Stop. Did they bullets come from? Where am I getting a light glare? I can live with that. Get up. Oh, 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 oh. better days. Remember that whole before the alien invasion thing? Those were good times. After the alien invasion? That's so good. That's so good. Oh, what, 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 what? What? What's that machine making that noise? Stop it! That's that same you can't get through the door sound. I'm sorry, but you can't get through the door. The troopers left me no choice. Now I don't have a choice. Let's hold up in here. It's the worst could happen. Oh, we're not really playing that speech, are we? And the sound of a door opening gives you the poops. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a key card? Why is your face all red? It's like really creepy looking. Did you pee yourself again? Key card? No. Key card? Or a PDA? Anybody get a PDA? We'll set up for our DAP. Side, nothing's trying to kill me. Yet. Oh good, I'm back to where I started from. Without the car. security clearance.
Sorry, bad feeling, bad feeling, bad feeling. That was my bad feeling alert. Used to be. Mmm. It's all malicious. Welcome mats do we have here today? Okay, it's good to get ammo, well, I don't mind that. <sighs> Some armor cards. Bravo team reports there's some sort of unidentified growth taking over parts of the base. I don't know what it is, but it can't be good. Stay sharp. What's a growth? What's he talking about? Growth? Like a plant? Plant life? to the systems we can't do it here we'll have to access the system somewhere else hi All right, let's go hello hey can you hear me what is this a one-way class hello where did why did you leave what you just sort of boom that's it see a marine have a nice day sir we're gonna leave you with death How's that one? Coming from? Are they behind me or are they in front of me? I don't know. Okay, good answer. No one's half the battle. Oh, hey, that's 
the cam, reloading! I'm in circles, I'm in circles. Bring it. Alright. We'll come back. Ugh. Thanks. It's this scumbag that I'm looking for. Where's your security clearance? Thanks. Banks. Missing person. This is the audio log of Director William Banks, dated October 20th, 2145. It has come to my attention that we have an alarming number of missing personnel throughout the base. My office has received four additional reports from Delta in the last week alone, mentioning that personnel are not reporting for work and that calls to their quarters have gone unanswered. Okay, Banks. My office has sent the names of those personnel to Mars City Security, and they have promised to initiate an investigation. But this news is very disturbing, especially at a time when we have so many people in the infirmary suffering from sudden cases of schizophrenia and other psychological disorders. I hope there is no connection between those cases and these reports of missing personnel. That alien interrupted Banks. This is the audio log of Director William Banks, dated October 5th, 2145. It has been brought to my attention by environmental services that the recent power grid changes have caused many non-critical systems to malfunction. The report explains that this is due to either intermittent power outages or lower than optimal voltage input. It also says that sufficient power distribution to all non-critical systems is becoming more difficult to maintain thanks to Dr. Vitruger place, and huh? his so-called optimizations to the energy stores in and yeah, around like the facility. Lion. I assured the director of ES that I would file a report with central authority over this. Yeah, and Vitruger listening when? I got to uh, get to the back door. What's new? Welcome to the Alpha Labs. Nice. Formerly designated Phase One by the Union Aerospace Offworld Research Division, the Alpha Labs began construction on October 29th, 2009. Was there this much blood before? I'm not feeling this. <laughs> I need grenades. Do I get grenades? Yep, I get grenades. Which one was it? Five? Pistol? What am I gonna do with that? Oh yeah, let's punch them. I'll just give up right now then. Hello, Marine surrendering. How can I help? Okay. Excuse me, sir. Will you let me in? No, you seem to be broken at the moment. Come back. It's kind of a stupid way to go. You're just trying to get me killed, aren't you? Oh yeah, this is not bad. It's wide open room. Oh. Okay. Hey, this is 
the room with the two dudes talking and then they left. They said that Marine can fend for himself. We're out the door. Well, thanks for nothing, boys. I'm afraid. I'm a little bit afraid. Paul Simons. I wonder if he knows that song, Me and Julio down by the school. Yeah. Well, that's Paul Simon. Jimmy is locked. Open this crap up. Connect. Log in, log in. Where's the login button? It's around there somewhere. Log in to gain user access. I know it's not working. Cry out loud. Not an idiot. Well, not much of an idiot. Mr. Simons, network security. Why is it not working? This is Paul Simon, security okay. specialist in IT. Our network security has been breached several times over the last few days. Now, it looks like it may have been going on longer than that, but whoever did this really knew what they were doing. They covered the tracks really well. I just happened to notice some log anomalies, or it would still be going on. The intrusion came on an encrypted carrier signal from the Delta complex. It piggybacked the virus on one of the supercomputer requests and it peeled itself from the data stream once it was inside our firewall. Someone on the inside there has to be responsible. Unfortunately, due to security in that complex, I can only tell it came from within Delta. There's no way to identify which machine or even which lab it came from. Whoever was in our system had access to all personal data, including medical reports. My team will be monitoring the network closely in the next few days, looking for anything unusual. End of log. Anything unusual. Well, like everything unusual. Anything unusual. Not everything. Just almost everything. You're not much of a help. Access granted. That was the scariest door opening ever. Received a report that you haven't reached Bravo team yet. We need to pick up the pace. Can't on it. Reaching the communication facility quickly is imperative. Let's see you do it then, hotshot. You're great at barking orders. Let's see you come down here and do something. Oh, I've left Mars City. Oh, well, thanks for nothing then. So is this going to open or what? Uh, be careful, you ask for Whoa, I'm not finished! Man. Let me in. Ooh, did I just say that? I'm changing my mind. Don't let me in. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a license to walk like that? I'm hearing way too many voices. Too many voices. Too many voices. For one guy? Why is it so dark? Crap. That's gonna get me killed. Come on into the light. Walk into the light. Hey, fat boy. You alright? He's okay. Get him a sandwich. Good times. Good times, fat boy. Got a Mickey D around here somewhere.
Unlock the doors. Thank you. But a light would be nice too. The UAC takes pride in its safety record. Please follow UAC procedures. Safety record? Really, lady? I don't remember places that have great safety records infested by demons from another planet. Maybe I missed something in orientation.
Yes, foggy head. Look at that. There you go. That's why we're not going to See ya. Tell your friends to say hi. So, I guess we'll jump down and see how long the giant laser then. Yeah, that's safe. They are for the UAC, its investors, and indeed the entire team. Ah, the giant laser cut him in two. What a bozo. Of our future. We have developed a process that destabilizes the atomic structure of polarized I like the giant laser. You watch just my back. Which are Thanks, then siphoned laser. off to create Thanks for another. Like alchemists of old, the elemental phase deconstructed. Research supervisor for the EPD project. Uh, the uh, the elemental phase deconstructor is fully operational, and the research data we have gathered so far is very impressive. Unfortunately, we had a terrible accident last week. Research assistant Patterson was calibrating one of the core committees in the chamber, and witnesses say he appeared to see something, so almost like uh, something was talking to him. And uh, he backed right into the particle beam. It was not a pretty sight as it took off the backside of his head. He lived a few minutes, although I'm not sure you could consider that living. But they say his eyes rolled back and forth. He was trying to talk, although after losing that much brain left, I'm sure it was just reflex actions. Anyway, due to this, I have enacted new safety protocols in the lab. We have stocked one of the storage cabinets with an emergency metal supplies. The code for the cabinet is 752. End of look. Thanks for the cash. the beam, I understand. Thank you. 
That's got trap written all over it. Hi, trap. How are you today? So, here's the deal. I have to run down that hallway. Hey, there's a jump button that needs to be pressed. Particle M U 
Lucifer. Particle Lucifer. No, particle Amu Cipher. Amule Cipher. A mule cipher. Why would you want to cipher a mule? That's a jackass. Oh, sorry. I don't know. Something to do with the particle <laughs> thing. Behind you? Behind you. I was behind you. Jeez, I just saw a bomb. Sorry. I meant for the bomb. Um, I meant for this thing. Bangy bang noise. Last time there was a bangy bang noise, this big gigantic pig demon jumped out. I said, Hi, how you been? Oh, I've been alright, you? How's the wife and kids? Dude! <laughs> Dude, you don't have a head! That's just not the way to get ahead in this business. Is that your teeth?
stop on the ceiling. Come on, come on. Oh, great. Now it's coming out of some guy. That's just a terrible way to decorate your home. Necessary. Oh, you're already gone, I guess. That wasn't very necessary. It's good to move by me. What? What? Hey, cool. <coughs> Found some. Hi! Chain reaction. Final score, barrel 10. Zombie, zero. What do you think of that one, Pat? Well, I gotta say, his play was all wrong. I mean, he moved right into the open, and all of a sudden the barrel just blew him right top. You know what? And now time for... Are you feeling down? Having trouble getting shot now and then? Grab the fuse cover!
terms. Ah. that? I don't know. Safer worlds for everyone. For centuries, people on Earth have waged war over two things vital to human existence, fuel and water. As part of its ongoing commitment to create safer worlds for everyone, the UAC recently unveiled its development of the Hydrocon. Though still in its prototype stages, the Hydrocon will, in one dramatic move, forever end all shortages of water and fuel. By splitting iron oxide molecules, the Hydrocon produces oxygen and hydrogen cheaply and safely without the need for large amounts of electricity. The hydrogen is then used for hydrogen fuel, a substance so versatile and clean that it can be used in everything from home appliances to today's most demanding rocket engines. A side benefit of producing this fuel is an endless supply of pure, spring-like water that is more refined than any earthbound spring. We envision a world where technologies such as the Hydrocon can be used to end drought and civil strife in impoverished nations where water or fuel have ever been in short supply. While always at the forefront of scientific research and development, Union Aerospace hopes that the creation of the Hydrocon will continue to make safer worlds for everyone. Oh, he startled me. Man, I never glad to see you. I thought it was all alone. It's been freaking spooky lately. The Hydrocon's blown a few circuits and is unstable. Be careful with that gun. A stray bullet into the glass shields could blow the whole area. I'm gonna try and get this thing stabilized. I'll head to the science office when I have this under control.
Safer worlds for everyone. For centuries, people know, on Earth have waged war over two things vital to human existence, fuel and water. As part of its ongoing commitment to create safer worlds for everyone, it comes the Hydrocon. Though still in its prototype, the Hydrocon will, in one dramatic move, forever end all shortages of water and fuel. By splitting iron oxide molecules, the hydrocon produces oxygen and Can I close the doors? Be kind of cool if I could. <laughs> 